New tonight, rocks as big as basketballs. Road crews say they had to haul off a large number of rocks that were, in some cases, right in the middle of Billy Graham Parkway. But it's too late for at least one woman who says her car suffered some significant damage. Fox 46's Derek Dellinger is live in the newsroom with what he found out about those rocks and an up-close look at the damage, Derek. Yes, and the big question right now is where did those rocks come from? And the NCTOT did make a point of telling us that, yes, there were rocks that were up, at least up until this morning, up along uh, Billy Graham Parkway. Parkway around Tyvola, up along the shoulder, and also in the road. But where they came from right now, it's a bit of a mystery. On Vicki Jerogulius's car, you see signs that, for lack of better words, it's had a rough week. And she knows exactly how it started. I was driving up Billy Graham, taking my son to his tennis camp, and all of a sudden um, it got a little bit chaotic in front of me where I noticed that there was cars pulling over, um, there was boulders in the road. And one of them went right under her car, a car that is low-lying. That boulder, however, was not. It was bigger than my son's head, and he's seven. It's really not that hard to see how this could happen. Cars passing by at a relatively high speed, and if something is in the road, just driving over something can cause a lot of damage. Gerard has told us the biggest issue is on Billy Graham Parkway near the Tyvola Road exit and areas where you notice dirt all over the road. She believes it's a sign something fell from the back of a truck carrying dirt and rocks, and the DOT says she may be right. Our maintenance crews went out to collect what was left of rocks or, or boulders or stones that were still out there. And when we got there, the majority of them were on the paved shoulder. But not all of them. And some, when we went out, were still out there, though off the road. I, think I heard one of them or maybe a couple of them were the, uh, up to the size of a basketball. The DOT says they have no idea who dumped the dirt and boulders onto Billy Graham Parkway. All Gerogulius knows is that one of them flew under her car and left her with zip ties on her bumper and a horn. It doesn't work. My bumper broke. I lost my fog light. Um, my son had to cut off the tire pressure modules. Um, they were just hanging there. And there's like a liner behind the bumper. So we had to cut that out too because it was just hanging. So you might be wondering what can be done if this happened or has happened to you. Well, you can file a claim through the state DOT, but the thing about it is, is that that claim does have to be processed through the State Department of Justice, and they might be uh, one of the ones that actually decline that uh, that claim. Uh, now, uh, as far as uh, anything else that you might need to be worrying about, the best bets, if you do see something like this happening uh, out on the highway, if you do see a boulder, a big rock that kind of needs to get out of the way, it is best to reach out to the DOT directly. Right. Yeah, I agree.